Hey guys, Alice here, and welcome to a brand new player review today. This time it's going to be my um, another Serie A player, and it's my third player review, I think, since FIFA 16 came out. And this guy's a right wing, and his name is Mohamed Salah. Obviously, I think most people know about him. He's very cheap, with things like 3,000 coins or something like that. And um, he's got a mix of pros and cons. Like, um, on the other one, I had mostly con, uh, mostly pros. But this guy, it was good. But then it, in some areas, he did lack a lot. Um, I'll get into the post straight away. First of all, best thing about him is definitely his pace. Yeah, like, every time you get him, just run. And eventually, you'll get to the goal without the defender even touching you. That's how good he is. Um, next of all, you got him playing on the right wing. And he's got a left foot, which is just brilliant. That's my style of play. I'm not sure if uh, other people play like that, where you cut in, you can actually dribble around players until you get to goal, then have a shot with your left foot, and it just dips instantly, which I love about him. Some players like Robin, it's just terrible for it, because you're playing on the right mid, and you've got uh, a right footer with two star weak foot, so you can't use your left foot at all, which that's the reason I don't really like Robin that much. Also, you got him... Um, his dribbling and control, which links to playing on the right wing, cutting with his left foot. This is the thing I always do, um, especially when you run in inside, like you run in and uh, aim for the goals. Um, especially his ball control was just brilliant, and running on the running with the ball, running with the ball was just uh, really good. Next of all, his finishing. Um, I didn't get that many chances going into the box with him because he was a right mid for me. But um, when I did, I scored like three goals or two goals or something like that. And um, it could have been better, but I definitely say it's one of the better things about him. Next of all, we go on to his cons. He's got four main cons that I think. First of all, his physical and especially his strength. If, um, if he didn't have any pace, this guy would be terrible. But because he's got pace and he can just uh, run past players, his pace, um, his pace like counteracts that strength. Um, but with that strength... Um, sometimes when he needs to speed up, before he does speed up, the player could just push him off the ball instantly. Also, he's got poor long shots. I was expecting to get some bangers from him from like 20 yards plus out, but I didn't get any, which was really annoying for me. I, I was expecting uh, some decent con uh, like compilation goals, but I got nothing from it. I got some skill goals, which was good. Um, he did. He does have four star weak foot and four star skills, like most of the other players I do uh, review. Yeah, apart from uh, skills, his long shots uh, were terrible. So if you're gonna make some start those style of compilation goals, or you want some uh, cheeky long shots, don't use him. Um, nationality obviously is Egyptian. You can't really link that many plays. The only another Egyptian I know is El Mahamedi for Hall. I think I'm not even sure if he's uh, Egyptian, but I think he is. And um, also his passing. I never really uh, did over the top balls with him because it just went straight out for throwing, which was really annoying. But that's going to be the end of the review. Um, I think I'm going to rate him a seven out of ten just because of those cons, which really annoyed me. But then um, apart from that. It was fine, really, especially his pace. And I loved using his pace, especially on the wing. So I hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, and peace.